the name of God, the most gracious, the most merciful, praise be to Allah, God Almighty, Lord and cherisher of the worlds, and may God send His peace and blessings upon Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, and those who rightly follow him until the day of judgment, Amen. Allahumma salli salam baraka ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. A sincere message to the Western world and the non-Muslims about the attack in uh, Orlando, uh, Florida. Me and myself, I have not watched the news. I heard what happened, have not watched the news. But um, just from the way the story sounds, I'm almost definitely sure that it's just um, a false flag and a false flag to blame Muslims again without proof beyond the shadow of a doubt so they could uh, enforce more laws against Muslims in the United States. Condemning something is one thing, but labeling it to a certain group without proof beyond the shadow of a doubt, that's another thing. So it's easy to condemn terrorism. That's easy for me to do. But to just blame Muslims or blame anyone without proof beyond the shadow of a doubt, that I can't do. I cannot just blame someone for anything if I don't have proof beyond the shadow of a doubt. And many of these stories, which labeled Muslims as terrorists, turned out to be uh, fake stories or false flags in which no one was arrested indefinitely among the Muslims. So um, condemning terrorism, okay, we can do that. But to blame Muslims without proof beyond the shadow of a doubt, I cannot blame Muslims. Um, Many of these stories, like I said, when the stories unfolded after a few months, it turns out... And another one was uh, Texas. When the attack in Texas happened, I remember, they right away they shouted, ISIS was behind it. That's when the attack in Texas happened, I believe, sometime last year. But, I think it was a few weeks or maybe a month later, they said there was no correlation between ISIS and the t attacks in Texas, in Garland, Texas. There is no correlation. Which means what? Which means if there's no relationship, it means they falsely accuse ISIS of the attack in Garland, Texas last year. So, this is uh, unacceptable to just accuse the Muslims of uh, uh, violence. And then it turns out the Muslims are not responsible. This is unacceptable. So uh, that's the part that I have a um, hard time doing. To just blame Muslims until I see proof beyond the shadow of a doubt. Because if that was your mother, your father, your grandmother, your daughter being accused of something, you're not going to believe it without proof beyond the shadow of a doubt. And at the same token, I am not going to believe Muslims are responsible for any act of violence unless I see proof beyond the shadow of a doubt. Now, um, I'm very tired. But that same token... We also condemn the U.S. drones that are still doing a good job of bombing Muslims in the world. We also condemn the U.S. occupation of Muslim lands, which is continued. We also bomb, we also not bomb, I'm sorry. We also condemn, not bomb. We also condemn the U.S. money that is supporting Israel, in which Israel is doing a good job of massacring Palestinians. We also condemn that. We condemn bombings of innocent people. We condemn terrorism of innocent people. We condemn terrorism of any kind. To kill someone unjust, unjustly, we condemn it. But at the same time, the ongoing U.S. drones that are doing a good job of killing Muslims, we also condemn that. And let's not be fooled. It is America that is occupying Muslim lands. It's not Muslims that's occupying American lands. So let's realize who the bigger terrorist is. The one who's occupying the innocent people or the innocent people who, out of frustration, act like animals after being treated like animals. We have to be realistic that who is the real terrorist. The USA regime and anyone supporting them and occupying Muslims' countries. The USA regime and anyone supporting them and occupying Muslim lands. The USA regime uh, bombing Muslims and anyone supporting them in that bombing. These are the real terrorists, not the ones who out of anger act like animals after being treated like animals day after day, week after week, month after month. Thank you and peace be upon those who follow the right guidance. I repeat, I condemn terrorism.